Hello all you precious people. Welcome back to the channel. I'm Kelsey. Today's video is a Dollar Tree haul and I also got Dollar General combined today. I decided just to put it together and we're going to start with Dollar General first but be in prayer for Miss J and her family on the loss of her son Joel and I know there's others that has experienced loss or something so let's remember each other and be praying for one another and we're going to go ahead and get this started. All right. Dollar General and the, I got these, I got two of these coffee cups. They were $3 and I got them for 30 cents. So I didn't hardly pay anything for these coffee cups. I love the green and this, this, it just is really pretty. So I got two of them. The other one I am using, it's in the kitchen, but I brought this one that I'm not using to show you guys. So I got two of them. Then I got these little signs. These were $4 a piece and they're just like little signs you can sit out. But if you didn't like the colors, you could always paint them. I'm not paint them I'm not sure like all these were four dollars a piece but I got them for actually actually for 40 cents so I got cook I'm gonna try it okay then I got I like this one the yum I'm gonna try to reamp my kitchen after holidays I believe that's what I'm gonna do because I got all my Christmas out if y'all not seen all my community tab all my Christmas out <laughs> and then I got eat so I got those for 40 cents a piece and then I got two of these. I thought mom might want one, but she said she didn't want one. So I was like, well, I could always re I could always use it or I can e even give them as gifts or like my thoughts was to like, like paint it and then put a picture there. But this, these two, uh, they were $5. I got them for 50 cents a piece. Like this is the equal different ones. I got two of them. Really neat little, little signs. I thought they were cute. So, if I don't use that part of on the white, I'm just going to paint it and put a picture on it. It's my thoughts on it. Or personalize it to make it gifts. I like I like trying to get stuff like that that I can redo things. And then this, it was missing a piece on it. It looks like a cutting board. It was 70 cents. And it's got little hooks on it. But this is really cute. I thought I could just put something else there or something. I'm not sure what I want to do right here, but it was missing something. And it's got the little hook right here, but it's it's really simple and cute. Very farmhouse, I thought. But even I thought, like, probably to glue one of these on there, if you could get it to stay. If you wanted to, I don't know. Just a thought. It might be too big. <laughs> but something like that would be really good to cover that up if you can find it. And get all this hot glue off. I wish I could get this piece off. Or get all the hot glue in. I think it would be fine like this. I don't know. All right, now on to the Dollar Tree. Let me get adjusted. Um, I feel ah, there we go. No, okay, sorry, my back is hurting. All right, now Christmas Dollar Tree. First things first. Um, but oh, before we jump into the Christmas stuff, I uh, grabbed another one of these for the boys. And we've been watching, rewatching the Power Rangers from my generation the very first ones so i got them the green ranger because ryan had one but gay didn't have one so i got him one he said he liked the green ranger so i pitched that up for him and i also got one for myself too remember his family he just passed passed away and very sad very sad on that then okay another thing that's not a christmas item is um, what i got for bethany it's just one of these little blind bags these are called the career figures in barbie and you can collect them all this is what it looks like and you, these are the dolls you can get and i don't know if there's a cheat code on these or not and you can get 16 of them so i'm gonna i think i'm gonna put that in bethany's stock and if i don't give it to her now y'all know how i am about giving them their stuff <laughs> i i am bad I get so excited. I want I want them to have it. I'm like, here you go. <laughs> All right. Now, on to the Christmas stuff. We'll go with what um with um what I didn't get to show y'all last time. I didn't get to show you these three plushies. These are the three plushies that Ron had got. Was the snowman, the reindeer, and Santa is what he got from last time. But this time today i found the gingerbread man for him so i thought that would be really cute together so he's gonna be really excited to get him is he not cute i can't find the mr and mrs gingy yet but i did find another gingerbread to go with ryan's little set so that's fun for him 
and this is by oh and this is all by Christmas house is what it's called then um okay then I got some pot cleaners by Cracker Square I got 45 pieces in each one of these these are the tinsel stands is what they're called they, I couldn't find no red and white so what I got was the green and silver and we're gonna make me and the kids we're gonna make like little pot cleaner candy canes to go on their little silver tree I thought this would be cute and fun for them Instead of like making the little candy canes out of the pot cleaner and the beads, I just decide for to twist for them to twist these and bend them and voila, there's their candy cane candy canes for their little tree. I thought that would be fun for them. Like like um the little elves if, if there's any kids, disclosure, go away right now. Don't want to read the magic for y'all. But the elves are coming tomorrow. And I didn't get a chance to bring them in to show them to you because I got them hid where my kids won't see them. But, um, and I got the three, I got three of them from the Dollar General in the book. So, I thought I'd just share that with you a little bit. But that's going to be their thing to do with the L's. Yes. Alright, next I got the curling ribbon. And this is the 80 feet by Christmas house. You get the gold the silver the red and the green and i liked this one because of the texture on it i don't know if you can see that i'm sorry my light is really bright in here and sometimes it makes my hair look like it's look like it's lighter than the this and it's not i promise you it's a lot it's darker than this but look at my hair it looks so neat when when i have it pulled up like this it looks like i've got <laughs> it's really neat all right but I got that for their stockings and then other stuff for Christmas, so I picked that up. Then that thing um, I picked up is some of the lights. I need another wire light for my little tree in, on my little shelf. Those little ball brush trees is what I'm doing. This way I'm wrapping these lights around that ball brush tree because I only have one set to do one, but I didn't have the other set to do another, so I picked up these. So and Oh, guys, if if you don't know, there's all kinds of different lights like this. There was like red, blue, and green. And then, then the white lights, be careful because they do have the copper ones or the silver ones. If you can't see that in the box. There, see, there's the silver. There we go. There's the silver in there, but they also have the copper ones. So just be watching out for that. Just to let you know. Then I got the blue snowflakes for the kids' um, reindeer on the wall. I did this on my other little trees. I put some of these on my other little trees. That's on my mantle, and they look, these lights, they're bright. There's no need for more lights with these, uh, these babies. <laughs> they're bright, super bright. Then I found these. These were really high up. There was like red and green ribbon ones, but these white white ones they were really high up i had to have somebody help me get them down because i'm only four nine i'm not tall i had to climb shells climb climb ladders have things to get things down on those high shells <laughs> but somebody helped me thank you to that lady that helped me today and then i got these these are also leds um with the ribbon oh and all these take double a batteries guys i forgot to tell you this and i got these i thought this would look good around my little, I didn't show y'all the picture of my stockings on my little rail, but I got a rail that I got, I had hauled the bell, wire bells last year. I like put them around there and I'm going to put these around there to give them some more because I was looking for greenery, but I couldn't find no greenery. I would really like to put there. And then I also got the hints. Double batteries. I got two packs in the sets by the e circuit, and I don't have no problem with these batteries. They, they have served me well. <laughs> they have served me well, especially in my remotes and lights and stuff like this. Then um, I got I found these. Um, I did take these a, pic, a picture of these on my community tab. I thought these were really pretty. Is these lights right here? They look like little bubbles inside there. I thought that was really pretty. That's where the lights is gonna be. But what you do is pull out the tab. Make sure your tabs are in there. Make sure you have your stake because they do tend to fall out easy and you don't notice it. Because I noticed it in my bag that one was out. So I got two of the green ones. And then I got two of the red ones. 
if I feel like I need more lots like this in my yard, I will go back and get some. But let me show you a sample of what they do. Let me pull out the tab. And, oh, look, guys. That's what it looks like. No. Do they change colors? <gasps> they change colors. What? Does it say it on here? No, they don't say it say it on here but sometimes on the tag it will say what color they are sometimes that's how i found out about my little wire lights what colors they were but that is so cool so cool white i like that yes i might go back and pick some more of them up those are super nice put some of those in put some of those in my yard to give me some christmas lights because i don't want like I don't want like Christmas lights and stuff like that in my yard. It I just don't. I think this would be fun and light up my yard some for the kids to enjoy and for me to enjoy. But oh, anyways, these are my last three items I got off track. Um, I got this song last last time and I forgot to pull it out to show you. But I, you know my obsession with reindeers. My tree, my trees and everything is reindeers and snowflakes, and I love Rudolph. So that's my Christmas thing. So I picked up this little reindeer sled ride sign. Five dollars per ride, warm blankets, and hot cocoa. That is in that is going in my kitchen um, next to the refrigerator. That's where I put all my fun little holiday stuff. At. So I, I am going to put it there. Guys, be aware of the glitter. It does come off, but nothing hairspray can't take care of. They also had a green sign light. It said... Something about the trees, or no, it was the right one with the green trees. But the other, there was another one with hot cocoa, I believe, was green sign. So there was three of these i seen, but there's more. Let me know. Then I was looking for the round ornament light signs with the beads that says hot cocoa, bar no, gingerbread house, or something like that, to put in my kitchen next to my blessed sign. But I couldn't find that, so I found these snowflakes and I was like oh, this is even better this goes with my theme and it says Mary across here beware guys there is a lot of hot glue on these and I love that buffalo print it's got behind there this is very neutral and farmhouse but it's got my theme too so I grabbed two of them to put in my kitchen but they had another one it said peace and it was like more of like that plaid look with the red and the green more of the Christmas colors but I picked this because I really liked it so that is that is all of my Dollar Tree haul. Thank you all so much for coming by the channel. I love you guys. I am so happy to get to be on here with you and share all the goodies. And I hope everybody has a Merry Christmas and enjoying the season. And that that we come together come together and have just a wonderful time time, us and the kids and any other loved ones we want to share our time with. And I just love you guys so much to pieces. And God bless you. Let my life be the proof of his love. Have courage and be kind. I love you guys. Bye.